Hey guys, what's going on? Seen Previous here, and today I'm bringing you part two of the Harley Quinn story pack. So let's get into it and continue. So last time we left off at around halfway to the game. Well, you just saw 40% way through, but I I've already played the game as I said in my last part, and yeah. So up in the left side corner, you will see what the current objective is. And if you're retarded and decide to watch this before the first part, well, I'm talking to you. That's an inside joke. You don't get it. And then I'd highly suggest to go to the second part. I mean, first part. You are watching the second part. Don't watch the second part. Unless you already watch. Never mind. This game's too complicated. Like the whole X-Men universe before Days of Future Pass. Now, back onto it. So we're going to fight Nightwing soon. And I wish they'd make another, uh, sorry for the, uh, newbiness here. But, um, I wish that they'd make another, uh, Nightwing story pack. Because that'd be really cool. Or just be able to play as Nightwing again. Other than the, uh, uh, what's it called? The Switch thing, the dual play, dual play. Which was a really great introduction to the series. So... Ah yes, the elevators. Harley Quinn, you cray cray. That is the most inconvenient spot for an elevator button. First it falls. I'm um, first an inconvenient elevator button. Now it falls. You will hear from my lawyer. Okay. Now why? <laughs> why did? The, no. Okay. I thought it'd be let me. Well, let me throw it. But okay. We'll get rid of that mistake, as my father told me when he was packing my bags, threatening send me to boarding school. Um, okay. Nice. Okay. This whole thing is an inconvenience. Ah, yes, I, how did I not see that? I've already played this, and how did I not see that? Okay. I feel like if I was left in the wilderness with a canteen of water and a bunch of cows and a grill and a knife, a machete preferably, I would still die. And that's basically what my last girlfriend did to me in the relationship. Okay, let's go get this guy. Swing. I love how Harley Quinn is like all badass and stuff. Not just like weak. Like some people would believe she is. And if you're still a retard and is still watching this part two, even though they didn't see part one, um, fun fact. They uh, f officially confirmed, as in they as being DC Comics, that Harley Quinn and Poison Ivy are in a relationship together. So I just think that's pretty neat. Oh, Mayhem Node. How did I not see this? Okay, we secured, we secured the basement. Don't make too much to man. Sorry, I'm just jamming out over here. Okay. That guy seriously just say arse and not mean it as a joke. Joker was wrong, Harley. Joker was wrong. Like roller coasters. The concepts of them aren't very complicated, but they sure are fun. I mean, it's just a vehicle that moves around on a bunch of railings. Still fun, not very complicated concept. Why does she like feel the need to not wear anything? Like, her body is just ruined from all the poison ivy stuff. I mean, if she had clear skin, she'd be pretty sexy. But, you know, she doesn't. Can you stop, guy? You feel like one of those waiters that just doesn't let the people take their time and they're like, oh, I see you need. Okay, you're going to. 
like they're just like I see you need a little, like you need a little more time and you're like yeah and then they come back like 50 seconds later like this is my first time at the restaurant and that's another video we'll get to later but like I said here's Nightwing and Alanquin I mean we are in Bloodhaven so what how did that not work You should stay out Bloodhaven, you should have stayed into your dad's freaking genitals and not get conceived. We both should have done a lot of things, shouldn't we? You know what, you guys are just annoying. I feel like I'm gonna die soon if I do, I apologize. Ooh. Okay, Nightwing, you're going down like I did with Mr. J, is what, that's a missing line that Harley Quinn should have said by now, but Roxy lost it in the files. Okay. Okay, so that is how you don't play this game. Now, in my next life, I will show you how to play the game. Sitting on bed, huh? You never said a heartless two man job. I'm not the hooker hair paying one. Why is he smoking a cigar when he has like freaking metal in his throat? Okay. Okay, well, sorry, I skipped that, but it would have been pretty annoying. Okay. I like the sound effects in this game. They just really convince me that I'm beating a man's face in. Well, I pressed the triangle button three times there. Like, what are you doing? Are you serious? I can't do that. Let me do that last time. Technically, I am in, so you can't really say much to that, Nightwing. Okay, this has all been shits and giggles lately, but I'm gonna really start try to play because I'm almost dead. Are you kidding me? I went for the freaking police van. Or, I jumped, I jumped. Okay, so remember how I said this was how you don't play the game? That was a trick. So if you really want to know how to play a game, Wait for this. Okay, Joker, you just said that's the woman who loved Joker to death. You can't say that. Uh.
You're getting two personal there, 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 Harley Quinn. How did it get from there to there? I'm sorry. I just like spaced out there. <laughs> nighty night, not uh, huh? The pun. Nighty night wing, nighty night wing, night wing. No, whatever. It doesn't even matter. I'm sorry. I'm sorry that I even talked. Okay. Well, this looks like we're at the end here. Thanks for watching. Bubble butt, bubble bubble bubble. Bu bu um. Thanks for watching, Stephen Bruce. Um. Signing out. Have a good time.